Yo guys, Ashan here, and today I'm back bigger, stronger, and better than before. So, the world has had a lot of crazy stuff recently. You have Andrew Tate, you have Daz Black making these comments about Andrew Tate, you have Sneeko, you have Tristan Tate, you have a lot going on right now. And you might be wondering, where have I been? I didn't upload for like three or four months, it's gonna be here somewhere. I can barely remember either. Last video I recorded was, I think it was a boxing VR. Boxing VR, world's greatest boxer. I didn't play VR since that moment. I played once with my friend when he was sleeping over at my house and that was it. I haven't played any VR since then. I haven't played any games since then. I barely even play my Xbox anymore. I play Fall Guys here and there. But what's happening with the channel? What's happening with the world? What's this title of the video about? First thing I'm gonna talk about in the video today is where have I been gone? I was gone for like three or four months. Last video was boxing on VR. I didn't give any announcements on why I've gone. I didn't put on my Instagram, I didn't put on my Twitter, I didn't put on my TikTok, I put on nothing. I didn't say anything, I just went. But realistically what happened, if you look at the dates, three or four months ago, that's when I was in school. The second I left school, I was on my summer holidays, I didn't do anything. I didn't edit, I didn't upload, I didn't record, I didn't play games. Thinking, what did I do for the summer? I just went out to the gym every day, did the Friday, on the weekends I just chilled, watched movies, ate takeaways. I was gone for another two weeks, to Lanzarote, it was really nice. Back to school today, Monday, I don't know what day this is going to be, hopefully before Friday or on Friday, but this is Monday and I'm back to school now, so I have a routine set, I'll have my morning set, I'll have my afternoon set, I'll have my evenings, I'll have my YouTube videos coming again, hopefully twice a week, you might be thinking, that's one less a week than previous, but the videos are going to be better, everything's going to be get better, I'm not going to go on about me all the time, I'm going to go in to Andrew Tate, Tristan Tate, Daz Black, Sneeko, all this in a couple of minutes, I just want to make it clear what I will be doing and what I have done. So I've been busy all summer with gym and friends and family and holidays. For the future, I want to be uploading once or twice a week good edited videos. I want to be doing some gaming, some reacting. I want to do a lot of debating, a lot of realistic stuff. Reacting to serious stuff, not just trying not to laugh and not be cringy videos. I want to actually react to real stuff. So that's where I was and what I'm trying to do. So now let's get into the important part, the world right now. So you might be thinking, what's happening with the world right now? So obviously probably clear of this guy called Andrew Tate. Andrew Tate is the top G, the best specimen of man ever. Everyone is saying he is the biggest terror to the world. It was on the news, it was there, it was here, it was everywhere. It was even, like, it was on the biggest news reporters on the world. What happened with Andrew Tate? So, they blocked him on nearly everything. So, what happened was, Daz Black, you should all know him, Daz Games, he's the YouTuber. I used to watch him, don't watch him anymore after that video. But, I used to watch him all the time. Uh, Daz Black made a video about Andrew Tate, about how he is sexist, misogynist, how he's done really bad physical attacks to women in the past, which were not true, he has no criminal records. So what really happened was he made this video, made fake lies about Andrew Tate, or he got videos that were out of context, or that didn't have the truth, and they put them into this one big video, and he posted the video. So Meta, uh, Mark Zuckerberg, all this, they just banned him. He was banned off Instagram, banned off Facebook, he's banned off everything. So he basically silenced for saying the truth. But you might be thinking, what did he do or what did he say? Well, he's done nothing. He's, he's said some stuff in the past, but anyone could take stuff in the past and put him in the future and make it bad. Like if you look at my videos, I've been uploading for uh, two or three years now. I think I'll be starting in 2019. Um, and it's now 2022 that's three years of me uploading I think you could take how many videos I have and you could take a couple out or you could take a good bit out and you could take clips out of context and make a three minute video of me sounding bad or looking bad but realistically it's just not true is it you just took clips that were out of context and made them into a video and about myself I don't want to be in a world that silences men for speaking about the truth Andrew Tate is just here to speak about the truth of men he's here to speak for what men want to say but we're afraid to say he's speaking for us all it's like you, uh, women they are feminists that speak for the women we have Andrew Tate to speak for the men and I might lose subscribers for this and I might lose this or that but I'm here to show me and Andrew Tate has done nothing wrong he's inspired me to get better at the gym get better at life try and do better at school try and make money I'm now actually making money on the side here and there for the side hustles babysitting but Andrew Tate he inspired me to get bigger and say I want to speak the truth Maybe I'm only uh, 14, maybe I'm too young, but I'm going to speak the truth for men. I'm not going to be silenced and cancelled in a world that men can't speak. In the future, if YouTube doesn't do me good, or if I get cancelled for trying to speak the truth in the future, I will be moving to Rumble. 
uh, everyone go check out Rumble. Rumble link in description, not sponsored or anything, but it's link in description. Because Rumble, you don't get cancelled for being a man and speaking out. You don't get cancelled for saying the truth. Tristan and Andrew are on Rumble. Uh, Sneeko uh, might be going to Rumble soon. I'm not sure he said in past live streams that he's thinking of going to Rumble if he gets cancelled. He already has a strike on YouTube for doing absolutely nothing. He was doing push-ups with a top on and just speaking the truth again. And for some reason, they put a strike on the channel. But a lot of videos that are speaking the truth about Andrew Tate and speaking the truth of the world are trying to, like, they're trying to just put it down. The Matrix. It's all about the Matrix. We are living in a Matrix. It's not like we have some chip in our brain. But we have these governments, these people, these richer, these higher people in the world trying to push down the lowers and are trying to make the low people just not look up to them. If you look at Andrew Tate, he didn't have that much power. He has a lot of power to men's uh, mind. He's an inspiration, but he didn't have as much power as people like Mark Zuckerberg with all his money, Elon Musk with all that money. So he didn't have all that. So what did they do? Because Andrew was climbing that ladder and becoming up and up and up to the top of the matrix. They cut him down. Well, they tried to cut him down. Obviously, that didn't work because now he's on Rumble with all these fans. It's like these matrix. They make the men and the women fight, the black and the white people fight. But they don't want you to fight with them. Like Andrew Tate, if you look at Andrew Tate, they're saying he has done many bad things to him, but he has no criminal reports. He has no police reports. He's never been in prison. Nothing like that. So they're making lies or they're making these false accusements to get people like him down and down and fall into the normal people to argue amongst themselves. Like, it's that simple. They just don't want us to be trying to fight with them. They don't want us to be focused and locked in on becoming the top. They want us to stay down. This have just got out of control with what I'm saying, but it's true. These people are controlling us, they're putting us down, they're cancelling us, they're making us not speak. And I just want to say, look, if I get cancelled, I get cancelled. But I want to start speaking the truth from now on. I want to be me. I want to I want to be a man that can speak out for the rest of the men that are afraid to speak. So, you're know, thinking of 14, of a YouTube channel only has 150 subs. I'm not doing successful. I don't have high views. Yeah, I mightn't. But I'm going to still push and push and push to make the views go higher and higher and higher. And I promise you... Someday I will have more subscribers than 150. At the end of the year, I'm aiming for 200. If I don't get 200, okay. As long as I gain one extra subscriber. If I lose subscribers, that's okay. As long as the real fans stay and the fake fans go. As long as my views are okay. Like I don't mind if I have one view. If that one viewer is loyal. I just want loyal views. I don't want a million views. I want 100 views that are loyal viewers. That'll watch the end of the video. That'll watch it all. So I think that's going to be the video, guys. I've said everything that I wanted to. I spoke out. I said what I'm trying to do. I said where I was gone. So... The next video, don't worry, the next video won't be like this. But the next video will be a gaming video or a reaction video or something fun. I won't always be serious and, and arguing with the, with the Matrix. I will actually try and produce real content. I won't try and have all this argument and debating stuff. I will have some of that. And I will have more of that in the future when I react to videos. If you want me to react to some videos of uh, of Andrew Tate or Daz Black or Sneeko or anything, comment that down below. But next video will probably be Boxing VR again. Because I really want to try and complete that game and show you my progress. Or I could do some Xbox. Or I could do some uh, React. I could do whatever. There's a new Call of Duty coming out. I could do that in a few months when it comes out. And when I have it bought. So I will have a lot more coming out. We won't just be this guy. So don't worry about that. But I hope you enjoyed the video. And if I lose followers, I lose followers. If I lose subs, I lose subs. Uh, what happens, happens. I've spoken out. I've told the truth. And I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to come back for the next video. Until then. Bye.